Good morning YouTube. Today I'm going to show you what I do for meal prep. So I'm just about to head out to the shops and buy some stuff and then I'm going to come back home and take you through everything that I do. I'm going to show you what I'm wearing today. <laughs> Guzman style work hoodie with my sweatpants. It creates a nice contrast with these two colors like those. Then I've got my Kobe's on. You can see down here. Yeah. And we're ready to go. Let's hit the shops. Before I go to the shops, I have a weekly list that I have on my phone saved in the reminders. I think it's really helpful if you just have that. And then if there's anything else I need to add, I just like add it in before I go. So this is what it looks like. Woolies is a place I shop at. You got chicken, salad, apples, etc, etc. And then that means I'm not going to forget everything. There you go. 10 a.m. weekly. And we're done. So I like to do my shopping quite fast, just go in and out, get everything, make it efficient. Um, my girlfriend called, she lives in San Francisco, which is pretty cool, so I had a quick chat to her for a bit. And yeah, I'm gonna talk to her later. So here's a nice surprise talking to her. I'll see you guys at home and we'll do this meal prep. See ya. Back home, ready to start meal prep. So, I'm gonna go through today chicken, brown rice, sweet potato, spinach, and butter. So, this is what I do every Sunday for a couple of hours, get it all sorted for the week so I don't have to worry about it during the week. Chicken to start with. So, I've put down a bit of glad wrap and a board with a saucepan. So, pretty much, I just pull apart all these chickens, four chickens, put them into here and then after that I'll start cutting them up and weighing them. So I remove all the skin, um, I don't want any of you know, too much fat in the chicken, I just keep this bag here so I'm putting all the stuff I'm not using in that bag and then it's just easy, keep it clean and tidy, straighten the bin afterwards. It's quite a tedious process, like Sunday meal prep would usually take me about two hours. Um, so yeah, it's just something you just, if you want results from your, your diet, you just gotta do it. Make sure you go underneath as well, there's still chicken underneath. When you're done, just place it in the bag. Then that's taken care of. Clean up the board a bit. One done, three go. So the chicken is pulled apart. I'm just gonna clean this area up a bit and then I'll chop it up. Next step. So I'm just cutting up the chicken, so I just grab a few handfuls, put it on the chopping board, like so, and then I'm just gonna chop it into little pieces, like so. It doesn't matter about, I don't care how food looks, I just eat it, no worries. All right. Then make sure you have your Ziploc bags open or your Glad bags if you're in Australia. And then I'm weighing out 200 grams. The bag weighs four grams, so I just go 204. There we go. There's one bag done. So I'm gonna need uh, two different weights. I've got four days where I need 180 grams. So that's usually like, that's gonna be my dinner. Um, so I cycle between tuna and chicken for dinner. So I'm gonna need four 180s and then the rest I just do as 200 grams, which is during the day. Okay, so chicken is done, it's in the bags. Uh, before I put them in the freezer in the fridge, I'm just gonna write on the 180 gram ones because obviously you don't want them getting mixed up. <laughs> All right, so they're sorted. So what I do with chicken, if I'm gonna use it um, today, tomorrow, or Tuesday, I'll put it in the fridge. The rest I'll put in the freezer and pull out the night before. Brown rice, which is two cups uncooked, which will be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'll do this 
Saturday and Sunday. So Saturday I'll do two serves which last me for the weekend and saves having to make rice during the week. too much. Just chop them little pieces and get it done. The sweet potato is just about to get boiled. I cook them for between seven to ten minutes. Depends like how it's looking. About seven or eight but yeah so with my main carbs so i'm doing the rice and sweet potato i have them monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday i'll do pancakes for dinner because that's that's pretty easy and mix it up so you don't get go crazy about eating normal food all the time and then i'll go back to uh rice and sweet potato on the weekend sweet potato is getting cooked i'm gonna get started with uh, the spinach. This is the easiest part of meal prep. I love doing this because it's so easy. So what you're doing is uh, putting about three handfuls of spinach into glad bags. Um, that will probably last me about half the week and then I'll go shopping Wednesday and do the same thing Wednesday night and then I'm set for the week. Okay one lot of sweet potato is done. Boiling away. So I'm just gonna drain that one and it can sit for a bit as I finish off the spinach and then the other one is gonna finish shortly. So spinach all finished, there's a lot. It's going straight in the fridge. The uh, other sweet potato has just finished, so I'm just going to drain that. And the rice is almost done as well. Okay, so that's meal five, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And I have sweet potato with it. And I'll just put it in the fridge. Sweet potato next, so I put in simple bags, 300 grams each, and that'll be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then next weekend as well for leftovers. <laughs> Again with uh, the sweet potato, Monday, Tuesday will go in the fridge and the rest will be in the freezer. Last thing for meal prep is butter. So I chop that into 25 grams and 50 grams, which changes throughout the week. Okay, so that's the end of the meal prep episode. Uh, big thank you to Jackie for um, requesting an episode on this. That's pretty much what I do for my weekly meal prep. Um, there's more meal prep I do each night, which I'm gonna do like a mini episode on sometime in the next few weeks. So that's about you know 30 minutes worth of little meal prep just to fill up the rest of my meals throughout the day. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you've got any other ideas that you want me uh, making a video on, please let me know. All right, thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.